GoPro Volta. It's not Voa or Volta. It's Volta. The definition of Volta, producing voltic or voltage and electricity. Yeah, let's just get on with the video. Hello, welcome back to the channel in Aberdeen, where in the same week in April, it can look like the North Pole. Then the next year, back to foggy, cold Aberdeen. Yeah, the weather here is quite terrible. God, Aberdeen's crap, is it? No way! Aberdeen rule! Yeah, no, I suppose I love Aberdeen. <laughs> So in this video, you're going to be getting an unboxing. Uh, you're really getting the full biff down in this video. I could probably separate into three, but no. I thought in case, I thought just for this one, I would just throw it all in one. Uh, so to start with, you're going to get the unboxing, then you're going to get the specs, and then you're going to get what I think about the actual battery grip. Sorry, I've, uh, I've, I've literally just seen the Ferris wheel and it looks creepy as hell. I don't know if you, yeah. Uh, just with the fog, it just does not look right. So, yeah, um, also it's supposed to be kind of like a Four Seasons video. Uh, like, literally this week it's been, the snow's been mental and it's all gone. Um, I was kind of hoping we'd get some nice weather. It's Aberdeen, right? I mean, you, you film one week, it's perfect weather, and then the next it's snowing, and then, hey, then you're back to the, you're back to this. So, uh, so yeah, let's go straight to the unboxing. Right, let's not waste any more time. Here's the box. Right, I'm gonna bump up there so I just touch. Yep, here's the box. It's slightly open. Right, let's uh, let's not waste time. Let's get it open. <laughs> um, I've got I've got an absolute butcher's knife today. So um, yeah, um, let's see if I'll need that. Um, you know what? I don't know why I bring a knife because I just rip right into it anyway. What's the best way of ripping this open? Okay, already this is the worst unboxing channel you've ever seen. Right, we're in. Okay, um, I'm gonna hide this because it's my address. Uh, okay, we packaged very well as you can see. Um, here's what I see. I'm gonna slightly hide that. So, yep, it's from GoPro. I can't see any of my information in there, but yes, here we go. I'm gonna get that up. Here she goes. That's her, in there. In the box. Here we go, there she is, in the box. Let's get her out. Right. <sighs> yep, there she is. The Volta. Right, let's get you to focus. The Volta. Right. Now we'll get her open. The tape. Ah, here we go. So, here's what I see in the box. So, here's the box. Um, one thing I like about GoPro, and if you buy it from them, you've got the subscription. And even if you don't, you have the lifetime warranty um which is pretty cool there she goes the name volta battery grip tripod remote weather resistant which is a big deal i suppose um you have the drawings on the back yep which looks pretty cool this versatile grip amps up your gopro yep that's why we're here to watch the video so there you go um nothing really exciting on the back um so yeah oh oh this is this is you know, I'm just shut. Nice. Okay, so let's uh, let's see what we see here, right? Okay, and that's the box and all the stuff inside it, but that's not what we want to see. But what I will do for the context of this video is stick her here because it is the Volta. Okay, right, shut up. So, yeah, this is what you see coming out of the box. Um, yep, yeah, so it's all in its 
thing. I don't know why I get so excited with an unboxing. I don't know why it's content either. Like, because when you open it yourself, it's like, oh, this is good. But like, when you watch other people do it, it's even more exciting for some reason. But anyway, here we are now. So this is it. Um, got this stick. Um, let's get her up. Why am I making this so much harder than what it needs to be? Uh, I need two hands for this. I could have just wore the chest mount and the GoPro, but I didn't, so. Ah, right. Already, um, just holding this, it feels like a good material. Um, yeah, that already feels like a, a decent, solid material. Um, holding it, it's quite tough which is always what you want, I suppose. Um, yeah, I like, I like the grip on it. There's no rubber grip on it, but like, I don't know why, but even when you like, hold it in that, you can see that you're all printing that, which is pretty good, um, I must say. So I'm gonna get her open. I always have a trouble trying to get these things open to start with, but. Ah, clicks. I like a click. None of this, you know, just a click, like, it's got three magnets there which I like. Yeah, it's got three magnets there, and that is something that I do like. So, like when you close it, there's no messing about it. You know it's closed, and when you open it, it feels like it's open. So, and even when you have it at a, open like that, you, you know it's open. You, you know it's open. I like that. Um, there's a button here. I'm going to press and see what happens. I've got a feeling what does happen. GoPro, well done. You've done a good job already. That's all I can say. <laughs> I like it. I really like it so far. Um, yeah, you do get the impression that it is weather sealed. Um, what I mean by that, by that is, is that it's got. I said it does. It's not rubber, but the more I hold it, the more I feel it. Um, it 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 does have like a. It's got that coating on it. It's not, I don't think it is rubber, but I don't know. Um, but it does feel weather sealed. And like even the buttons here, there's no like actual holes or anything like that, but they're quite stiff, which is something I'm like, oh, it was on there for a sec. It's on! I accidentally turned it on. There you go. <laughs> Does it come with I think it comes with a door pass. Get you in focus. Um Yeah, it's got the door pass on it. Um which is pretty cool. I mean, it's almost like you don't actually you don't actually need the, the media mod for this. Um, obviously the media mod's good. Um, I don't actually have it on me. I sent it back. Um, not because it isn't, well, not because I don't like it, but the fact that um, when the flaps have gone, I'll put a video later. Um, but yeah, I like that. Um, it's weather sealed as well, which is good. Yeah, and you do feel that. I mean, here, um, it's like a rubber seal as well. You've got a bit of foam here. Which is something I really want to test out, so um, yeah. And it's Aberdeen, so it's gonna rain, so I'm gonna try it out. USB C cable. Yeah, one of these. You know what? These are everywhere when you don't need them, and they're nowhere when you don't need them, so nothing wrong with having that. And that's, that concludes the unboxing. So let's, uh, yeah, let's just give it a shot. So I'm gonna take the door off the Hero 10 for a second. Which is really easy to do. Um, this isn't a how-to video, but yeah, everything about the GoPro is so easy in that. Um, shut that off. Uh, so, yeah, let's stick it on here. Hmm. Look at that, it's, uh, okay. So, there's a gap through it, if you can see that here. And like, one thing I was gonna say is that I almost felt like it was quite more flexy than the than the actual door itself, but okay, so there you go. Um, that's that. Let's get her in. Get these open. I'm gonna stick you in here. Yeah, you know what? Everything about this is so easy to put together, you know? It's just not fiddly at all. I mean, like, no disrespect to like, third party. Um, designers that does things around the GoPro and that, but it's just so easy to put together, like, um, I just love that, that's it together already, you know, how good is that? Uh, why am I on 100, 
I just realised I'm on a hundred. Damn it. Uh, yeah, that's going to totally mess things up. Yeah, that's annoying. I was on a hundred shutter speed, I don't know why, but I'm on 50 now, so. So, okay, that's that. Uh, let's get connected. Right, let's get her in. And yeah, it has that seal as well, which I like. Um, look at that. That's it in. Oh, it's just turned it on. I've, no, it's charging. Right, that's what it is. So, so it tells me how much battery there is. So if you press it, you press it once, it tells you how much battery you actually have. Okay, that's pretty cool. Um, it's already full, which means it's good to go out of the box, which is something that I quite like. So, I'm going to turn the GoPro on now. Probably not as I turn the beeping off, because the beeping is the most annoying thing in the world. Um, look at that, updating Volta. That's, um, so the software update is already kicking in on the GoPro. Um, that's interesting. So I'm assuming it's a swivel. Is it? Does this thing swivel? I think there's going to have to be a bit of uh, RTFP here. No. RTFM. Read the flipping manual. Because... Obviously when you put it down like that, you don't want it to look like that. You want it to be facing the other way. Next. Can you hold it upside down? It'll still work. Yep. So let's go on. Next. Is that complete? Volta can now be used as wireless remote and with media mode. Cool. So uh, that seems to be it. Um, I really want to know how you twist it. Aha, look at that. That is one thing we have been screaming for from GoPro is this. It's quarter inch thread. I think it's quarter inch, I don't know, but it's the most, it's universal, that's all you need to know. And um, so, the, stand, the DJI stand, um, use it for my camera right now, I could, why I would want to do this I don't know, but even just to sit up on top of my tripod, that's, see, it's like a double, yeah, but anyway, that's something that we have been looking for. So, let's kind of get to the point here of what we're wanting to do with this, so. So if I hit record, without having to do anything, it should just record itself. Yeah, it does. Look at that. Impressive. I am the kind of guy that gets out of the box, doesn't read the manual, and then works something out like six months later. That's it's happening right now. So the Bluetooth button. So it says you could just swivel it. Am I just being weak? Um. Ah, I was just being weak. Oh, ah, 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 look. Okay, now we're in business. Get on, baby. So now we are in business. So look, you twist it and it just clicks again. A click. I like a click. It's stiff. So I was proven wrong. Not wrong, but I was proving how stiff this is, and that's something I am okay with. There's nothing when something's too slack. And look at that. That's our. Uh, that's our bit of kit, like that. So let's take her on the road just now, shall we? With over four hours of filming on 5.3K at 30 frames a second, that's not including the battery, by the way. It's easier to control the camera with the buttons on it, which are quite firm, but it's quite good. It has tripod legs, which is always handy. You can control the GoPro uh, 30 meters away, which I still need to test, which I'll probably do this video right next after this. It has a weather resistant design and it supports the media mod. Probably two things that you probably would want to combine together. So yeah, back to Glenn and Sunny Aberdeen. <laughs> Why would I buy this battery pack? Well, I mean, the name says what it is on the tin. It's a battery pack, um, waterproof battery pack. Um, it's a battery grip. You grip onto it. I mean, 
two things you don't really want to mix together is a battery pack and water and there's times where I have stuck my GoPro on a tripod or a mic stand, duct tape a uh, battery pack to the hell just so no water would get in I mean now I can literally just stick it out like that and set it up and know it's going to be fine for the next few hours and with this on the bottom I can even stick that on top of a tripod and not have to worry about uh, any water damage or anything like that um, so that's a big tick I also like how you've got that I mean that just that just opens up the creative edge to what you can do with GoPro and the accessories you can get with it, like sticking on a suction cup if you're wanting to go for a long drive somewhere, do like a hyperlapse or I don't know. Even like the GoPro backpack I've got, which is sent away right now, video comes through for that. You could like clip it on and if you're doing a hike or whatever, it's just, I love all that. It's really good. Um, and I was also testing the distance of um, how far you can control it with it and I was impressed, it was further than the phone could reach. Um, I must admit, I was scared that seagull was going to fly away with it, but um, no, it could go pretty far. I managed to take a photo and try to control the video with it. And yeah, I was surprised at how, um, how much the phone struggled to pick it up, but yeah, <laughs> that's just one other thing. And um, it's limitless, this, I think. It's just, and I think GoPro are doing some pretty good things just now. Um, and I was laughing the other day, I was, I was starting to think my YouTube channel's turning into a GoPro review channel, but it's just one of these things that where it just keeps coming up where there's things to talk about and stuff to review, and yeah, it's not a bad thing, uh, in my opinion. So I think that's all I can really say. It's, it's, it's a fantastic tool to bring with you if you want to do a long hype or anything like that. It just saves you having to carry five batteries or buy five batteries when you just buy this. Um, so yeah, I think a lot of good things are happening with GoPro just now. Um, and on that note, I would uh, just like to say thank you for helping me reach 200 subscribers. When I started recording this video, at the start of the week I was at 190 subs and yes, at the start of the week it was really snowing and all this was white, <laughs> believe it or not. And now it's like cold and it's all gone. Don't ask anyway. Um, yeah. And now I'm at 205 subscri uh, subscribers, which is incredible. I was, I was thinking about changing the, the 100 sub video, the highlight of my page, but I think I'm gonna keep that for a thousand. It's probably not gonna be this year, but I, I don't mind. I'm getting a bit addicted to it, I'm not gonna lie. I'm loving that people's interest in what I'm talking about, and uh, I can kind of bounce off people in the comments as well, um, which is why I started this channel, is just to kind of talk about things that I enjoy, and I'm glad people are enjoying it too, so thank you very much. Um, I know it's not a lot to some people, but when you're paying attention in the analytics, it's quite a big jump. I mean, I also didn't think I'd get that much when I only aimed to upload three videos a month, um, which for some people isn't a lot as well, but it, it, it's the only way it works for my work schedule on that, and I enjoy doing it. Um, it just means I get more time to spend on videos like this. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad they're paying off. I'm glad people are enjoying them as well. So. Uh, yeah, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Uh, I've got plenty more in the bag where that came from, so yeah, thanks. Thank you, and uh, yeah, see you in the next video.